Senator representing Edo North Senatorial District, Adams Oshomale, has tendered a public apology to his colleagues and members of the Night Senate over a TV interview that may have misrepresented members of the Night Senate of allegedly looting their offices at the end of their tenure. The lawmaker's apology followed a point of order raised by his colleague representing Ogun West Senatorial District, Senator Solomon Olamileka, who highlighted a breach of his right by the interview in question. My colleague was speaking to Nigerians. He was addressing Nigerians about this Senate. And knowing fully well that it's not possible for any senator to move a pin out of this National Assembly without the express approval of the management. Mr. President, the procedures are clear. At the end of our tenure, all the assets in our office will be verified by the management. We will sign for it. And if anything is not complied with or any asset is missing, your severance payment will not be paid. I even thought that uh, it is fake news. So I'm surprised that my colleague is bringing it here, which means that it is true. Mr. President, that statement is misleading. It's very defamatory. And we will not take it as a Senate. I equally serve in the Ninth Senate. And I know that the content of that interview is false. So when you register your acceptance, you can now go away with those items. And you pay. You either pay through cash or you or through your severance, severance gratuity. So those items that were removed were removed legally. And it's tradition in every end of every Senate. So it's possible because our colleague is new, Mr. President. Our colleague is new. He doesn't understand this tradition in the Senate. Having been given the opportunity to narrate his position, Usho Malay apologized and said he actually defended the immediate past senators instead. I'm sure with profound respect, having listened to my explanation, you know that if anybody got the impression that I accused the senators that was certainly not the intention, and that was certainly not what I said. But for those who feel that that's in, uh, my comment, which was meant to protect our collective image, was offensive, of course I apologize. Because I cannot leave the comfort of my home to go and abuse a house in which I am a member. Thank you very much. Hello. Hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.